Hey everybody, it's time for another chemistry lab. Today your learning target is I can write a balanced chemical equation by observing a reaction. You're going to be using a new substance today. This substance is called calcium hydroxide or lime water. Its chemical formula is Ca and then parentheses OH2. Um, if you want to make an atom representation of this substance, you start with a calcium. On the outside of the calcium are two bonded oxygen atoms, and followed by two bonded hydrogen atoms. And there it is, lime water, calcium hydroxide, a clear liquid for starters. To do this lab, you're going to start on page 120 of your notebook. The first thing you'll do is get a plastic bottle. Um, actually, you're also going to be wearing goggles today. Before you get your lime water, put on some goggles. And using a syringe and a container of lime water, you're going to take the, cop, the top off the lime water and get 30 milliliters of lime water into your syringe. Measure it carefully and put that lime water directly into your plastic bottle like that. Then you're going to take a stopper and tube system that you'll see is in each of your lab trays and put the stopper and tube right into the bottle. It should fit the tube inside the bottle should be below the level of lime water. Then you're going to get a little plastic straw. It's wrapped up in a wrapper. Take it out of the wrapper and place your straw into the end of the long tube coming out of the stopper like that. Then you're going to breathe in and exhale your breath into the tube. It should make bubbles into the lime water. Each person in your lab group should get a chance to exhale by breathing in and breathing out through the lime water. You should see lots of bubbles. You should probably do at least 10 breaths of air. Observe what you see happening inside the bottle of lime water. Then you should complete the results section and conclusion section of page 120. It's a very short lab. When you are done, please take out your bottle and stopper. You can rinse out your plastic bottle in lime water. Just rinse it into the sink. And you may throw away your little straw chunk. Then you should open your notebook to page 121. You can probably do this back at your seat. Um, page 121, you'll also need a plastic baggie full of atom tiles. And the first thing you'll do for number one is make a representation of lime water. And follow the directions. And if you do it carefully, down by number three, you will make a balanced chemical equation to represent the reaction you saw in this lab. 